This jukebox and band are from the 40s. Let's just play a little maybe Buddy Holly for you, and then you get a really cool surprise. So look at this. Hang with me, hang with me, look! And the band comes out, and then we dance. Dancing is encouraged at the Chicago Land Show, where they have tens of thousands of antiques and games. You can get inexpensive items to the really expensive ones, like the tourist slot machine from the early 1900s. It's very rare, only one of five left. The cost? $75,000. Pull the, it's like a slot machine. You okay. pull the lever, and then a token would come out, and then you take the token to the bar owner, and then you would either exchange it for cash or maybe a drink or or cigar. So the, the beginning of a casino right here. 1910. Everything is for sale. It's a hot show for collectors with items from several decades ago, like way back in the 1800s. Dan Cooney buys these kitty rides from the 40s and 50s and then restores them. This good humor ice cream truck has all the bells and whistles. This is all hand painted, no decals. Uh, it's got bells, horns, coin changers, speakers. This one's kind of cool too. It's got a freezer in the back that you put dry ice in and you can actually have chocolate oh, bars. Oh, is that real? Because I'm hungry. This is from the Chicago World's Fair in 1934. There's a hold up in the back. Brooklyn's broken out in fights. There's a traffic jam. In you can get pretty much anything here. Chuck Gunther preserves car pieces from the 50s and 60s. It brings back memories from back in the day. Well, I do these 1950s Chevy trucks. Everyone remembers Grandpa had one on the farm, things like that. These back in the Model A's, remember that, hey, Grandpa had one in a parade. Now we have one on the wall to remember him by. So much cool stuff. The show runs through tomorrow, and then the curtain closes for the winter. In Gray's Lake, Marcella Raymond, WGN News.